we've tried. It's uh, something called chiaquiles. Um, what, what is the, what is the taste of uh, tacos? Because uh, I've, I've heard about uh, about it's very delicious. You've never tried one? No. Oh, you need to try one. They're amazing. They're definitely my favorite Mexican food mm -hmm. that we've eaten so far. Hi. Hello, Maya. How are you? I'm good, thank you. What about you? Good. Nice to see you again. The same here. Thank you. Yeah. And so how have you been since I last saw you? Yeah, I, I, I'm, I did it great uh, with my uh, English journey. And yeah. uh, like, uh, I'm so sorry. Forgive me if I uh, uh, speak, uh, pronounce uh, the letter uh, like uh, uh, the, the sound uh, TH instead of S because I've had an appointment <laughs> with, uh, with a dentist uh, okay. like, uh, two hours ago. And uh, I know I noticed I uh, have a session with you. I I for I forget about that actually. And uh, oh, really? yeah. And uh, in this moment, uh, I don't feel with my tongue, with my chin. <laughs> yeah, because the doctor. Uh, <laughs> so your mouth's a bit numb. <laughs> Sorry. So your mouth is a bit numb. Yeah. Now, what does that mean? Now. Numb. It means you oh, can't, no. you can't really yeah. feel it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because he injected me with, the, like, um, what do you call it? <laughs> uh, Insepitic uh, needle? Um, oh, um, oh, what's the word? I've gone blank. Uh, uh, Insepitic? Anesthetic. Anesthetic yeah. needle. An Anesthetic. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they're the reason that I uh, don't feel with my, with my chin. <laughs> that's, okay. that's all right. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, yes. It's, uh, it's been a, uh, I'm a bit, I'm still recovering from the jet lag of moving from Thailand to Mexico. So. Yeah, that's tell me about your, your trip. Um, uh, it, uh, about your trip. Um, uh, like, uh, like, uh, do you speak uh, Spanish? Spanish mm -hmm. there in Mexico? No, I don't. Everyone else does, but I don't. <laughs> wow! So, how can you communicate with uh, with the Spanish people, um, Mexican people? So, yeah, so I moved with my boyfriend, who's from yeah. um, Argentina, so he speaks Spanish. Uh -huh. uh, so he kind of communicates for the both of us. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you have your own translator. <laughs> yeah, I just uh, we'll go to a restaurant and it'll all be in Spanish, and he'll be like, "What do you want?" And I'm like, "I don't know, just pick something. I, I don't know what it says." Um, <laughs> you, will, you will use your signs like, "I I, I need this and this." Thank yeah, <laughs> I'm like, just pick anything. You've been with me long enough to know what I like, and you know, we go to taxis and walking around the street and everyone's speaking in Spanish and I can just I just you know walking along don't know what ever, <laughs> anyone's saying um, he can just reply to everyone for me that's fine I don't mind so have you tried to uh, learn uh, Spanish before so I learned it in school um mm -hmm. so you know you do a few years of it in school like five years I think but mm -hmm. I was learning it to pass the exam you know if I'm honest uh my dad helped me and my brother with our Spanish and he yeah. he knew more than the both of us put together because from just from helping us to learn mm -hmm. um I was just learning so I could pass, pass the know? exam yeah, yeah like me like, like 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 me when I when I was uh, uh, studying English just the, yeah. the passing the exam yeah, it, I just didn't, uh, I didn't care at all at the time. Um, and then now, recently, I've been trying to learn it again um, mm -hmm. because my partner's family, like most of them don't speak any English mm -hmm. or very little. Yeah. Um, so I'm trying to learn it. But I, when I say I've been trying to learn it, I mean, like, I did. And then I, and then I gave up. And now I'm like, I should have. <laughs> Because I don't know Spanish. 
Yeah, yeah, you have to. So yeah. uh, in Thailand, uh, did you uh, like uh, try try to try to speak uh, in their language? I think uh, their language no. name is uh, it's Thai. Thai? No, no. I can say hello and I can say thank you um, in Thai. But where I lived on this, like, it was a really small island called Koh Tao. It's like it's super beautiful. Um, no. It's like this, you know, scuba diving. Yeah. It's a scuba diving island of Thailand, um, mm -hmm. but it's really tiny. So the people that we knew on the island were all like Westerners. You know, everyone spoke in English. Mm -hmm. We never really had to. I worked in an English speaking bar as well. Um, and I worked, I was a teaching assistant in the school teaching English, you know, like everything was always... I never had to learn Thai because it didn't matter. <laughs> yeah, I, actually, uh, uh, like the most worker maybe used to speak uh, workers uh, used to speak uh, English because yeah. uh, they used to uh, deal with the to uh, tourists like um, foreigner people, so uh, they have to learn uh, like. Uh, like um, uh, at least uh, the basics of English. Yeah, yeah. I mean, most Thai people from what it what I saw was uh, like everyone, they learned the English that was necessary to their profession. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if they worked in a restaurant, they knew English relating to restaurants and whatever they needed to know and like if you worked in the mechanic they knew that kind of stuff in english you know they knew what they needed to know to yeah. be able to communicate with the tourists to help their business yeah it's uh, like uh, it's necessary to learn uh, this language uh, if they want to uh, like uh, make uh, a good money Uh, with the, their job. So, Maya, can you take off your glasses because it's reflect my uh, picture? Yeah, it's better now. <laughs> <laughs> you could see you could see yourself in them. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, so by speaking about uh, like uh, food, uh, uh, do you have like uh, a favorite Mexican food uh, there? Mm, we've only just got here. We literally got here like two days ago. Um, mm -hmm. So we've tried, um, what have we tried? Uh, we've tried tacos. Yeah. Um, we've had, we tried tamales. Um, well, I can't remember. I wrote down the name of the things that we've tried. So something called chiaquiles. Um, what, what, is the, what is the taste of uh, tacos? Because uh, I've, oh. I've have heard about, uh, about it. It's very delicious. You've never tried one? No. Oh, you need to try one. They're amazing. They're definitely my favorite Mexican food mm -hmm. that we've eaten so far. Mm -hmm. uh, it's cheap here. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, the, you know, the cheaper food here yeah. is the Mexican food. Um, tacos are amazing. Um, Chiaquiles was like a weird... It was nice, but it was kind of like... Nacho chips. Uh, it's like it's name. like a sandwich. The chiaquiles. The no, tacos. Like, oh, tacos like a a wrap um, mm -hmm. with like meat and things inside. Um, so meat uh, like uh, fish or uh, chicken or beef. I think you can have all different kinds, uh -huh. um, but the standard is like maybe you can have chicken or chorizo or think you know uh wait like so if you if you like um if you if you want to feel uh, satisfied like uh, your belly is satisfied you will have like two three or just yeah one. yeah i think i normally eat like three because they're quite can you see here they're quite they're quite small they're not really big you know yeah uh can you see that yeah i can see Yeah, so that's what they look like. They're kind of flat like this here. And then you kind of pick it up and roll it up and you eat it from the side. Mm -hmm. So what did, uh, you or what did you order uh, there, like uh, the, uh, the meat? Is it uh, fish or uh, chicken or uh, just beef? 
oh, I don't know. We got chorizo and I don't know. My boyfriend ordered them all because they, they ordered it in Spanish. So I don't know what they were. Uh, so, but, but you, but you, te you, you nice. tested. <laughs> Whatever it was, it was really nice. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> so did you, did you like uh, had a drink uh, with it? Um, I haven't had an alcoholic drink here yet. Uh, the drink that we came, that came with it was like this watermelon water. It was like uh -huh. this one restaurant. It was amazing. Wow. I've uh, never tried watermelon, like just watermelon water before, but it was so good. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I, I don't know, um, if, yeah, I haven't tried many drinks He, different kind of drinks here yet um because the jet lag has been the biggest thing so far because there's a 12 hour time difference between Mexico and thailand so it's like our whole day was flipped you know yeah i i uh, <clears throat> like i have a, a friend from mexico and she told me uh, she told me like uh, we have like uh, eight uh, hour difference Uh, between between Iraq and uh, Mexico, so yeah. I suppose the 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 time there maybe uh, four or three. Three, yeah, it's three. Uh -huh, so three. For, so for the last uh, two years, I've been living mm. with it being twelve hours ahead. So in Thailand time, it's currently quarter past three in the morning, uh, yeah. whereas for me, it's quarter past three in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. right now so it's been a bit of an adjustment trying to sleep at night time which is like my normal daytime and stay it's away a, it's, it's a huge uh, like a huge uh, the movement uh, for you yeah it's uh it's been a bit of a killer and we've only been here like two days so it's still yeah. still a bit um still a bit tired but we'll get there yeah so um uh... About your uh, job, um, is your Cambly uh, your fr your first job, or uh, you have another job besides Cambly? Um, well, when I was in Thailand, I had other jobs, um, but because we've only just moved, um, I haven't got a job here yet. I think I may struggle or find it hard not being able to speak Spanish. I think my boyfriend mm -hmm. will be fine. Uh, yeah. I don't know, but I. I enjoy working on Cambly anyway. Like I'll probably just continue doing this. I don't want to give it up. Like I don't want to stop doing it. So yeah. um, I'll probably just continue doing this. And if I end up getting another job, um, then I'll probably do that part time. Um, just so I've got, you know, like a job to do while I'm out here. Um, but I'll probably continue with Cambly as my main job just because I like it mm -hmm. more than doing other kind of jobs you know i've done a lot of hospitality yeah, it's interesting to meet uh, to, to meeting uh, new people in Cambly. yeah for sure definitely yeah. it's one of the so, things that i enjoy <laughs> most about it so uh, this uh, is this your uh, first trip to uh, mexico um i went once when i was a kid with my family but it was like a family holiday you know so we yeah. spent a lot of time in the hotel on mm -hmm. going on organized trips Um, yeah. And I was like, I think maybe 12 when I went. So this would be the first time where I'm like actually exploring the area properly and probably maybe absorbing more of the culture than when I went last time. Because I think I was too young to appreciate it, even though I yeah. remember it being a great holiday. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it was a great holiday for, yeah. for you. Yeah, <laughs> just a it great, was a lot a, of a great, fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, you are now uh, like... Uh, Uh, older than uh, the, uh, that age, so you will uh, understand the, uh, the people there, the food, the culture, everything. Yeah. Appreciate it more. Like, I know my parents <laughs> put a lot of effort into that holiday. Like, I respect that, but I was, you know, too young to appreciate it as much as I, as much as I should have or as much as I would now. Yeah, 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 exactly. So, uh, one last question. Uh, like, uh, how long uh, the trip it took you from um, Thailand to uh, Mexico? About 45 hours in total. Did you fly or the, uh, by, by car? 
Yeah, so we flew. Um, yeah. So we flew from Bangkok to Tokyo, Tokyo to Toronto, and then Toronto to um, to Cancun. But with the layovers and the flight times, it took us about 45 hours. Whoa, whoa, okay. whoa. <laughs> oh, we are nearly out of time. Uh, but thank yeah. you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, it's great to see you. I'll uh, hopefully speak to you 